We heard on camera a Muslim woman say that she was in favor of child marriage. I'm asking you a question. Do you agree with child marriage? Yes, yes. Do you agree with child marriage? I'm not going to deny it. Do you agree with child marriage? Yes! Right, that is the problem. We heard on camera a Muslim woman say that she would not condemn paedophilia. Do you condemn paedophilia? No, I don't. You don't condemn paedophilia. Did you hear that? You alright, bro? The Muslims are doing their usual part. Sorry, show me your proof. Sorry, what's up? What's up? See your... this guy? What's up with him? He said the yeah. comment. Right, what did he say? Show me your proof. Show me your proof right now. Violent violent a violent religion. It is, isn't it? And then it does. We can't yeah, speak to him. And then you've got to you got to demonstrate. Wait, wait, wait. 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 Right. There, so one second, one second, one second. Right. So he's made the claim that the, 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 the argument. One second, one second. The, the argument is the argument. Which argument do you want to address? The violence. Do you want to address the violence or the paedophilia? The, 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 but you're not on your own. I'd be happy did Mohammed did Mohammed marry a six-year-old child? Did Mohammed marry a six-year-old child? Did he have sex with a nine-year-old child? Right. That's paedophilia. If you are a man and you have sex with a nine-year-old child. That's paedophilia. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Right, let's look at those conditions. Let's look at those conditions. Right? To consent to marriage, you need to be a mature adult, don't you? Are you telling me a mature adult is not a six year old? Are you telling me that a six year old is a mature adult? Right, just don't engage me. If you stand this side, and I stand this side, so, so do you not understand so, what it means? So, so one, second, one second, one second. A six-year-old child. Listen, don't worry about a six-year-old child. No, no, let's means? worry about a six-year-old child. A man, a a man si what, no, bro, bro, listen, you brought him to me. About the man, yeah. Yeah. Right. Do you know what I mean? No. When a woman starts, a six-year-old child. A six-year-old child. You know I mean? No, we're talking about the marriage. Okay, 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 yeah. She was yeah. prepubescent at the point of marriage. The nika was given at six. She hit puberty at nine. That means Muhammad married someone who, by your definition, was a child. Do you agree? Yes, I do agree. Right. So you agree with child marriages? No, I don't agree. So you don't listen, agree? Listen, right. Listen. Go on. No, no, no. Because one, she started her, um, her period. Do you know what that means? Not at six. No. Not at six. Yeah, but she has started. Not listen, at six. Listen, by the time she left the house to go um, and leave the house, yeah? Not at six. Listen. <laughs> Not at six. She left the house at nine. She was six when she got it married. She it does matter. Do you, you yeah, you agree with child marriages? Yeah, but you're. Do you agree with child marriages? You are. Um, Do you agree with child marriages? I'm asking you. I'm asking you a question. Do you agree with child marriages? Yes, yes. Do you agree with child marriages? I'm not going to deny it. I'm not going to deny it. Do you agree with child marriages? Yes! Right. That is the problem. The Mohammed's example has led you to the conclusion. Mohammed's example. Mohammed's example has led you to the conclusion that child marriages are okay. That's a problem. That's why it's a problem. Now tell me, according to Sharia law, at what age do you separate children, brothers and sisters from their bed? I'm asking you a question. At what age? Yeah. My question to shall we go over there? Shall we go over there and talk? I'm going to I'm going to connect the two together. I'll connect the two together. I'll get I'll connect the two together. I'll explain why I'm bringing it up. According to Islamic law, when do you separate brothers and sisters from sharing the same bed? I'll tell you when they are ten. So tell me why Muhammad married a six-year-old who was prepubescent, right? Meaning, and then had sex. 
and then had sex with a nine-year-old. He's a Catholic. She's asking you to shut up. Just, just. Right? The Catholic Church. Yes. Stop shouting. We're trying to have a conversation. Stop being rude. Right. So, so my point is, let, let's. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, James. James. Stand over there. Stand over there and keep calm. Right. No. Just, just don't. Right. Don't, don't, bro. Because I'm trying to have a conversation. Right. So let's let, let's have a calm conversation. Right. Calm down. Let's less heat, more intellect. Less heat, more intellect. All right. So let's let's try and have a calm conversation. Come on, bagman. You can't be drinking your own. Come on, bagman. He's full of atheism. Why is he full of atheism? There's plenty of Muslims around here who are full of atheism, bro. Scum. Bro. Please. Stop. If you can't control yourself, take a walk. Bro, if you can't control yourself, take a walk. Right. So, then, then stop engaging. Right. Right. Show Don't bite. Don't yeah. bite. Do not bite. He can't bite. Right. So let's let's just have a conversation, Jesus right? So so le, le, no 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 no. Let's have a conversation. The reason why this is important, right, is because because of Muhammad's example, you have just said on camera that you're in favour. That's fine. But you have just said on camera a, a human being. And a human being with a conscience, and a human being with the ability to reason. Now, in Islam, is it right to marry people who are not mature? No. Right. Is a child, prepubescent child, immature? Um, yeah, but you're, you are actually, like, like, don't say you're not, you are actually taking a 21st century child now and comparing it to them, you can't do that. No, 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 I didn't ask, no, I asked you this question. The question I asked you, the, the question that I asked you was, the question that I asked you was, is a prepubescent child immature? Why are you asking? I'm about, asking you that question. Listen, why are you going on about a prepubescent child? Yeah? I'll We're explain. Going on about Aisha. I'll Just explain. Stop, stop going around circles. I'll explain. Yeah? Every, well, uh, trust listen, me, everyone else listen, can follow the argument. I don't care what Go they're on. doing. Listen, right? Go on. I didn't drink Kofi. Fact is, she was six and then nine when she consummated the marriage, yeah? When did she get married? Yes. Please don't ask, just do it. Like, seriously, no, you just don't, do it. You don't know who I am. Yeah. Go on. Yeah. They got married when she was six. Right. Yeah. Should you marry an immature child? Well, well, obviously, her parents went along with it, yeah? But, well, That's not my question. Mate. Yeah, it is, because the child... No, had, no my yeah, question was, should you marry yeah. an immature child? Yeah. Should you marry? Would you, would you let a six-year-old child marry? Yeah, but you're... You're bringing back then to now. This is what I mean. You're too emotional about now. I'm really not. You, you really are because because you're thinking so small. You're no, not opening your no, mind no, up. no. There's nothing to open your mind up to. That we're talking about a child who cannot make an informed choice. An informed choice requires listen, 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 emotional listen, listen, maturity, listen, listen, and a six-year-old child does that, not then, have no, 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 emotional listen, maturity. Listen, you need to practice listen, what you preach, listen, and you need to listen to what's mouth. being said. Then, no, no one is your then. dimmy. No one is your dimmy, and we don't care about your supremacy. Give a f about you. Listen, yeah. Back go on, then, go on. Justify marrying children. No. Just, yeah, just justify marrying yeah. children. Back then. Go on, what? What? I know he's a little quiet. Yeah, back then. You know I was a choir boy, based on what information? Look at you. Look at me. That's yeah. that's your argument. This is how you're deciding facts. And that's I'm a little pretty boy over there. Is this how you're deciding facts? Listen to the listen to the arrogance and the conceitedness yeah, in your own heart. Me. Because I'm condemning a paedophile. <coughs> Do you condemn paedophilia? No, I don't. You don't condemn paedophilia. Did you hear that? She does not condemn paedophilia. You said that. No one put those words you in your mouth. Do you condemn paedophilia? Try again. Do you know what? Do you know, Do you what? Condemn Do you know what a paedophile is? Yes, someone who has sex with a child. 
Do you condemn it? Yes. Do you condemn it? I'm the priest and the choir boys. I condemn those as well. I condemn those as well. Do you condemn pedophilia? Do you, no, I'm asking you a question. I'm not trying to bother you. I'm trying to get you to use your yes. I'm trying to get you to use your reason. Use your reason. You know, clearly not, because now you've just said on record you agree with child marriage and you do not condemn paedophilia. Wherever she works, should recognise what she just said. Her employers should recognize what she just said. She just said she does not condemn paedophilia. Your employer should know what you've just said. So who's my employer? I don't know who your employer is, but I hope they find out what you believe. Anyway, well done, well done. You yeah. So you, now that you... No, no, I did no, no, not no. say it wrong. I did See, not there you go. She's it. just no. doubled down on it. Yeah. She did not say anything wrong <laughs> by saying she doesn't oh, condemn paedophilia. Dust, do you support that? Yeah. Do you yeah. support that? Yeah. Yeah. You see, yeah. Dust will yeah. never yeah. condemn it. Yeah. He won't yeah. condemn it. He won't condemn it. Answer. So, Aisha was six. Yeah, let's go over there and talk. Come on, let's go over there and talk. Yeah. Come on, come on. Yeah. Let's go. Come on. A man of bad faith. <laughs> yeah. Try. Yeah. Yep. Wait, wait, wait for and the wait yeah. for the camera. Yeah, yeah well tell them not to stop shouting because because I'm I can't control shouting. your if your friend shouts well, your and men, your supporter your shouts. No, that was Dust and um, Morocco well, well, that were shouting. So, I'll tell hey, you so you don't care when listen. they do it. Okay, no, 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 you practice what you preach. Let's have a conversation. Oh, right, so look, listen, right? Listen. Go on. The definition of paedophilia. I'm telling him what a paedophile is. Yeah. Telling him what a paedophile She's going to tell me what a paedophile is. I'm willing to bet a paedophile is someone who is attracted to children. You can hold my hand and then we can take me away. Listen, right? A she doesn't want to walk away. Now, notice the day you rattled, rattled. No, she wants to talk. No, you talk if you want to. Remember, Mohammed said you are half the intelligence of him, so you should listen to him. You're diminished in your intelligence, according to Mohammed. And the majority of women in the majority of people in hell are women. That's what Mohammed said. Yeah. If he's your husband, he might beat you for disobedience. No, Go on. My husband, right, so. So you just. By Listen the way, why aren't you lowering your gaze? Is she your relative? Who's watching her like that, Bob? Are, 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 are you are you are you not meant to like lower your gaze and have a deference? He's my brother. He's your brother. Yeah. Okay, so we got the relationship understood wow. now. Go on. So yeah. You're your guardian. Go on. Brother in Islam or brother no, by no, blood? No, no. No, I'm not a shaitan. I'm simply demonstrating that your conscience condemns your religion. Your conscience is condemning your religion. You condemned your own prophet. Yes, you did. You just need to open your eyes. Free yourself from these lies, love. So a paedophile yeah, go on. is a person who's sexually who attracted, attracted to children. children. Yep. The Prophet Muhammad <coughs> yeah, had, had sex with a child and married an, a prepubescent child. When she had just hit puberty. Yeah. And if we're going by the um, definition of a child, a, then she would not be the one. No, that's not true. Uh, it says it here. It says from what website? What's the website? What's the website called? Well, I don't know what the website is. Yeah, yes, you do. You just scroll to the top. What's the website? An email. Oh my gosh, she's quoting an email. I'm quoting an email like it's a fact. Right? No, no, no. You can walk away whenever you want. This is Speaker's Corner. Yeah, if you want to go that way, you can do. You can go whichever way you want. Then, no, I'm not moving just because you tell me to move. I am not your dimmy. No. Uh, no. And you're someone who has said on camera that you don't condemn paedophilia and you don't condemn child marriage. And I really hope your employers find out. I haven't got an employer. Well, not a surprise. What's the pushing for? What's the push? She pushed me. She pushed me. It's on camera. The arrogance. Yeah. And this is the point, guys. This is the point. This is the point, guys. This is the point. She lost the argument and then got violent. There you go.
That's what we're up against, brothers and sisters. That is what we're up against. Did you see that? That is the, the thing is, the thing is, guys, the thing is, Muslims like that make up a tiny percentage of the overall Muslim population. They do. Those two arrogant, arrogant supremacists with their bigotry and their hatred towards Christians don't represent all Muslims. But they do represent a percentage of Muslims. And that percentage of Muslims, if ever Islam was to dominate our society, would be the ones desecrating our churches and persecuting us in the street. This is why, Christians, we need to rediscover a more muscular faith. Because as you can see, those kinds of Christophobic bigots exist in the Islamic community. Those kind of jihadi wannabes exist in the Muslim community. And there's a high percentage of them here in the park. And if we can stand up to ethno-nationalists like the Nazis, and we can stand up to communists, then as Christians, we can stand up to Islamists as well. There's fault! There's fault! There's fault! Christ is risen! Christ is risen! We heard on camera a Muslim woman say that she was in favor of child marriage. I'm asking you a question. Do you agree with child marriage? Do you agree with child marriage? I'm not going to deny it. Do you agree with child marriage? Yes! Right. That is the problem. We heard on camera a Muslim woman say that she would not condemn paedophilia. Do you condemn paedophilia? No, I don't. You don't condemn paedophilia. Did you hear that? We have it on camera. She said it because she believes Muhammad is her example. So it is because of Muhammad that she will not condemn paedophilia. It is because of Muhammad that she said she was in favor of marrying six-year-old children. By comparison, we Christians believe that you learn with the best possible knowledge of your time and you apply your values and your beliefs to the best possible learning. Every study in childhood development demonstrates that a six-year-old child is not mature enough to consent to marriage. Every study of childhood development shows that nine-year-old children are not ready to have children. And we Christians elevated the age of consent in the fifth century. And that's 200 years before Islam. We raised it above the age of nine. Every society on earth is raising the age of consent, including in the Islamic world. And that is why we can see that Muhammad is not the example that we should follow, but we should follow our Lord Jesus Christ and the apostles. Any questions? Any questions? Do you have a question? Oh. Do you have a question? Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, you have a choice. We can build our society, its laws and its values on Jesus Christ that allows us to learn that prepubescent children cannot marry and that children who start puberty early should not be having sex or we can nail ourselves to the example of a paedophile from the 7th century 
who married a six-year-old who was prepubescent and had sex with a nine-year-old. And just as the Muslim that we had on camera said, she agrees with marrying children and she would not condemn paedophilia. Any questions? Yeah, Aisha was actually 16 when she got married and 19 and it was 14. Right, let's look at the hadith now.